Hello students. So we are doing chapter number two, Delhi, the mini India. So today we will proceed towards next topic that is places of interest. So Delhi is often referred to as the city of monuments. Delhi is blessed with several beautiful places and there are some of the famous places of interest in Delhi like the Red Fort is one of the most famous historical buildings in India. It was built by the Mughal Emperor Shah Jahan. It is made up of red sandstone. So uh, it was built by the Emperor Shah Jahan when he decided to shift his capital from Agra to Delhi and this building is made up of sandstone. So sandstone is a type of rock which is used in the construction of building. The next one is the president of India stays at the Rashtrapati Bhavan. So Rashtrapati Bhavan it is the official residence of the president and it is located in Rajpath. Then the secretariat building has many important government officials. The secret building is the department that fulfills its central uh, administrative or secretary duties means it is the department which fulfills the central administrative duties so next one is Qutub Minar Qutub Minar is a tall tower situated in Merauli next India Gate India Gate is a historical monument built during the British rule this is the India Gate Next, Jantar Mantar, Jama Masjid and Old Fort are some of the other famous monuments in Delhi. Next is Transport. So, Delhi has a good network of transport. The non-polluting compressed natural gas buses run through the city. So, in Delhi, Compressed natural gas transportation is used in order to protect the environment from pollution. So, uh, due to the construction of flyovers and modern bridges and the Delhi Metro Railway uh, Rail Corporation, the transportation system in Delhi has improved. So, uh, with the modern transportation system, it reduces the risk of road accident, isn't it? Then it also helps in reducing traffic control and also it saves our time and fuel of our country. So, uh, so the Delhi Metro is an economical and eco-friendly means of transport. The Indira Gandhi International Airport is... Uh, located in south west delhi the headquarter of the northern railway is also located in delhi so the next topic is life in delhi so people come from other states to settle in delhi they follow their own culture and customs this is why Delhi is also called Mini India. So in Delhi, various people from different states with their different culture come and settle down for various purposes. And that is why Delhi is called Mini India. Uh, and in Delhi, various languages are also spoken. So some of the popular languages are Hindi, Punjabi, Urdu and English. Delhi is famous for its street food. So in Delhi, we get various type of 
uh, street foods and which is so much popular and very tasty so next uh, national festivals such as the republic day independence day and gandhi jayanti are celebrated with much enthusiasm in delhi so in delhi this national festivals are also celebrated very beautifully on republic day a grand parade is held on the rajpath as the president of india hoist the national flag and takes the salute next one uh, on independence day the prime minister hoists the national flag at the red fort and addresses the nation and on gandhi jayanti the leaders of the nation pay their homage to mahatma gandhi at his samadhi at rajghat some other important festivals are diwali eid holi guru nanak's birthday and christmas so as different religion people live together that is why every festivals are also celebrated by all people together okay so this chapter is finished and i have given you the question answers so please do study at your home thank you